Thank you. And welcome to You Bet, the show that is a celebration of human skill, daring and achievement. Our next challenge tonight could be the pits or the chequered flag. 24-year-old Henry Hope Frost from Surrey is a motor racing fanatic. He eats, sleeps and breathes a sport. He must have a very sore throat. Henry says that having been given the year and the country where the race was held of any of the 564 Formula One Grand Prix between 1950 and 1994, he'll give us the name of the winner and the make of the car and the engine. Tonight, Henry will try and identify 15 races chosen at random. Please welcome our Grand Prix guru, Henry Hope Frost. <laughs> Bit of support here tonight. Yeah. <laughs> Where are this lot from then? I've never seen them in my never life. Never seen them before. <laughs> <obviously, so laughs> so Don't you want to be a racing driver then? Yeah, please. Well, then why aren't you one? Um, costs too much money. I'm too big. You're too big. Mm. Why, why do you have to be small to be a racing car driver? Well, because the cars have to sort of fit around you. You have to be, you know, nice and small to get well, in the get car. Them to make it round you. <laughs> and to mould it. More money, isn't it? Well, now, what is this thing about money? Everybody says it costs a lot of money to become a racing driver. Why? Um, I don't really know the answer to that. It's just the way it is. You have to start when you're very, very young. You know, you can't go to school and you've got to be, you know, totally dedicated from a very early age. Now, there, there are 564 races that yep. you have got to give us... Well, you're obviously only doing uh, 15 chosen at random. That means you know all 564 races since 1954, and yeah. you know everything about these races. Yeah. Now, I'm fascinated by the fact that people find that they have these talents. Do you spend every moment of every day learning these facts? No. You just find that you just know them? I just took it all in, and, yeah, just... Yeah, and yeah. You're, you're, what, 24 now? 24, yeah. 24. I mean, where are you hoping all this will lead? I mean, what possible use can you put this to? Absolutely none. <laughs> Splendid, that's what I like to hear. <laughs> bit like this programme. Yeah. Utterly useless. Where are you going? <laughs> where indeed? <laughs> Stick with me, let's find out where any of us are going. Okay. By asking Robert to tell us whether he thinks that you can do this challenge or not, Robert. He's a nice, respectable looking man, yes. Uh, Bruno. I too am a, a motor racing fanatic. Always wave the flag for Damon Hill, so I'm going to go yes on this one, big time. Splendid, thank you very much, Bruno. Copstick. Well, I think a level of knowledge like that about things like motor car engines is not natural. No. Nope. <laughs> On principle, I'm going to say no. Oliver, it's sort of irrelevant what you think, really, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, no, but just for old times' sake, let's... Old times' uh, sake. Well, horsepower. I don't know. Horsepower. Horsepower. No. Well, neat. Uh, tell the truth, you two look like it's sort of been working together and... <laughs> I don't trust Matthew, so I'm not going to trust you either, so I'm going to say no. Very wise, thank you very much. Oh, you've gone for no? Oh, yeah. I'm very surprised about that. Two yeses, two noes there. Let's see what our audience here think. Right, well, we know what your mates all think, but place your bets now, please. And don't forget, do this at home! Unless you've got something better to do, and if you have, I want to know what it is, and a doctor's note. You've got more mates than I thought you had. Well, there's... 81% say that you can do it. I hope it doesn't put you under too much pressure. So, please, can we have our Grand Prix grid? You come over here with me. Now, whatever you do, don't say the first thing that comes into your head. You have plenty of time. If you want to pass on any of them, do. And we can always go back, okay. all right? Yeah. Let's go. Joseph at Lotus Ford. That's the one. 1950? Giuseppe Farina, Alfa Romeo. Yes. Keki Rosberg, Williams Ford. Right. 88 French. Alain Prost, uh, McLaren Honda. Well done. 52 French. Alberto Ascari, Ferrari. Well done. 56 Monaco. Pass. 69 Monaco. Graham Hill, Lotus Ford. Well done. 75, Brazilian. Carlos Parche, Brabham Ford. Well done. 
70, Monaco. Yock and Rint, Lotus Ford. Well done. The late, the late great Ayrton Senna's first win in a Lotus Renault. Well done. 54, Belgium. Pass. OK. 59, United States. Bruce McLaren, Cooper Climax. Well done. 80, Belgium. Didier Peroni, Ligier Ford. Yep. 69, British. Jackie Stewart, Matra Ford. Well done. 55, Monaco. Maurice Trantignon, Cooper Climax. Uh. Oh, no! What? Oh, I can't believe it. You're doing so well, I don't know. Thanks so much. I have never seen you get that wrong. No. We've been working on this all day, and that sometimes happens on the night. I'm really sorry. You deserve to win that. Ladies and gentlemen, Henry Hope Frost. <laughs>